graduated from law school, the very first thing that I purchased was Bulls tickets. I was making a lot of money at the time, more money than I could spend, and I was working very hard, so I didn't have a lot of free time, but I bought Bulls tickets. It was 1983, and I remember very well because it was the year before Michael Jordan was drafted. So at the time, I went to the Bulls, and a fellow named Joe O'Neill ran the uh, tickets, and he still does today. And I went to Joe and I asked him, I want to buy tickets because I'm a Bulls, I'm a fan. And I actually was a fan of the other teams because the Bulls weren't very good at the time. So uh, Joe asked me, where do you want to sit? So I picked out some seats in the center court. And to this day, 31 years later, I have the same seats at the same spot in the same location at the Bulls game. I've gotten to know a lot of really, really, really good people. And those people were like me. They started out and they were fans, but they also did it from a social standpoint. So these were many of the leaders of the Chicago business community, bankers, investment bankers, private equity fund managers, asset managers, businessmen. Um, we, we formed a bond over the years because we watched the team grow and we watched the team get over the hump and win and then win more. And then we've watched a lot of lean years. And over the years, the same people that we grew up with in the 80s and 90s are still Bulls fans today, and we enjoy the games together.